saving lives. Today, I'm instructing my administration to halt funding of the World Health Organization while a review is conducted to assess the World Health Organization's role in severely mismanaging and covering up the spread of the coronavirus. 十四号，美国总统川普宣布停止资助世界卫生组织。川普表示，美国纳税人每年提供世界卫生组织四至五亿美元。相比之下，中共每年捐款约四千万美元，甚至更少。As the organization's leading sponsor, the United States has a duty to insist on full accountability. One of the most dangerous and costly decisions from the WHO. Was its disastrous decision to oppose travel restrictions from China and other nations? 另外，川普被记者问到是否会让世界卫生组织秘书长谭德赛下台时，他表示正在调查中。他不认识谭德赛，但他知道这个人有点问题。美国国务卿蓬佩奥周二表示，美国寻求从根本上改变 WHO。美国联邦参议员杨恩·吉什考特等七人联名致信世界卫生组织秘书长谭德赛，信件开头便指想了解 WHO 帮助中共掩盖疫情讯息一事。他们要求谭德赛在内等多名 WHO 领导阶层人员提供去年十月一日至今年三月十二日期间所有疫情相关电子记录、书面资料、硬碟、电子邮件往来及讯息内容，要求谭德赛说明和。是得知中国大陆出现类似 SARS 病毒。新唐人亚太电视张启林综合报道。